All right, so here are Jacob's buddies, Kevin and Kyle's over there somewhere. There he is. And they are helping Jacob, who's over there somewhere, and Brad. And I cannot believe in just an hour and a half from the pictures that I took yesterday and the video that how much is gone. Is it helpful having that piece, honey? Is it helpful having that big machine? Oh, yeah. yeah, huge, so you don't have to lift. Yeah, that would be horrible. What do you think of it, Kev? Good? Kyle, good? Thanks for helping, guys. Huge, huge help. There's my sweet boy, Jacob. Yes, that's me. <laughs> Clark's at work, so he'll come later. And we're still missing Joe Kramer. So I put it on document on tape that he's not showed up yet to help us, and he said he would. So, Joe, that's your challenge. I love you, Joe. So what about the bricks right there? Kev just pulled up the... No, I walked out and it fell off. Oh, it fell off. <coughs> Sorry, all the... <laughs> The limestone piece. <laughs> That's gonna come off. All right. That's gonna weigh a ton. Somebody help, guys, help Kev with that. There is our dining room that Kevin is standing in right now, or not dining room, our, our eating kitchen area, <coughs> and has no walls right now, but it will have walls in a couple months. Here is the view from the back of the house. <laughs> You can see it's basically all open. The room, the walls with the eat-in kitchen have been torn down. We had to do that because we decided to do a screen-in porch in this area. So the floor wasn't gonna work out. So we had to actually tear those walls down. And we were losing most of them because of the windows anyway. So pretty open floor plan, literally. Open air floor plan. Be a great house for Hawaii with all this open area to the outside, but not such a great house for Chicago. So can't wait to see the walls and the windows go in here in the next few months. Well, here we are. The boys have worked for quite a few hours today. It's after lunch and they have cleared so much stuff. This entire floor was probably about two or three inches above our ankles with drywall, insulation from the ceiling and just a bunch of stuff. So they have worked their little butts off. They still have room to do back here. They put a dent in it slightly, but this insulation is it itchy. And a little bit of this room to do. And now Clark, my older son, has shown up from his work and now he's coming in to help, but they really don't have a lot left to do. Boy, honey, you guys have done moved a lot. Very nice. There's Clark starting work. There he is. Hi, bud. Hi. <laughs> so now they're trying to take the limestone ledge that was, we don't, it was just, I guess it was for decorative use, just the extension of the house. There was nothing really behind it. So we're taking that apart. We're saving some of the limestone to see if there's any chance we could use it somewhere, but I don't think we'll be able to. That, that wall was probably about five feet tall. Well, now they've got it down to nothing. See Kevin. Who's not leaving? Wait, are you leaving? Yeah. Oh, who's taking you home? You. Oh, me? Okay. 